Seems like it's been a long time since a flag's been waving here. Phew. No chance. Though the pole is quite brittle, I'm just not strong enough. There's an engraving. Kalita has her ears in the water. Huh? I like candlelight. It reminds me of my mother's grave. Hey, there's my shovel. It didn't survive the flight. The handle's broken off. Ooh. That could have been my spine. I wonder if the rope bridge will remain stable if I take one of those. How am I supposed to ring that bell? The bell rope is missing. I wonder if that's where Kalida lives. Hmm. Locked. Hello? Anybody home? Hmm. Nobody there. Hello. Hmm. What? Who? A clown? What are you doing here? My name is Sadwick. I have to prevent the world from collapsing. <laughs> yeah, very funny. But don't waste your time. You won't be able to boost my spirits anyway. Who are you? My name is... Uh... Uh, my name is Bondo. What? Bondo. Come again? Bondo. Bondo. Waldo? Bondo! My name is Bondo! Holy mackerel! I am Bondo! Bondo! How often did I tell you to keep it down? Ah. Uh. Look what you've done now. We woke the boss. Uh, he's sure to punish me for that. Why are you so unhappy? Does the impending end of the world bother you too? The thought that all could soon be over? Oh no. That's something for others to ponder. I don't care if the end is coming. On this island, we're done for anyway. You see, there's nothing to do anymore. Ah. I'm looking for Kalida. Who are you looking for? Kalida? <laughs> You're a real clown, aren't you? Why? What's strange about that? No, wait. Let me guess. Kalida is dead, or she never existed. <laughs> no. Kalida exists all right, but you'd better leave her alone. So where can I find Kalita? I already told you. Leave her alone. It'd be best if you didn't make any noise, so you don't wake her up. I'm not supposed to do what? Wake her up? So she's grumpy in the morning? So what? What's the big deal? Will she throw her pillows and complain about the coffee? Right. Or she could change into her full height and lay destruction upon the village. Uh, Just believe me, you don't want to wake Kalida. I'm beginning to wonder myself. I have to find Kalida. The world will collapse if I don't. Uh, do whatever you want, but I'm not helping you. Uh, 
I don't want any trouble, and I don't want to be blamed when disaster strikes us. Uh, just a moment. I don't want that either. So you better let her sleep. What do you mean there's nothing to do anymore? It's been quiet here since the boss closed the factory. Factory? Pearls used to be pressed here, but the production has been discontinued. I see. Why is that? Well, the boss met his goal, 10,000 pearls. And now, he's afraid of losing everything. What he fears most is that someone could wake Kalida. He's really paranoid. I can't make the slightest sound anymore. <sighs> it used to be different. I was allowed to do the most thrilling jobs. I used to blow the foghorn in the house of the howls. And come noon, I was allowed to ring the bell, which sounded all over the entire island. But the most thrilling job was the work in the factory. Hot air. Thick smoke and the noise of massive machinery drowning everything out. Womp! Kaboom! Ha 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 ha! Bando! What's going on down there? Be quiet, will you? Or do you want Kalita to wake up? Oh, oh, oh dear. You see what I mean? Uh, the good old days are over. <sighs> ah, well. About those former jobs of yours. Ah, the good old days. What do you want to know? What was that about the House of the Howls? Ah, those were the days. Every time big boats came to the island, I was allowed to sound the big horn. Toot! 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 Bando watches over this lake. His call sounds as far as Corona. Toot! 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 Bando! How often do I have to tell you? Be quiet, will you? <sighs> well, those days are over now. What was that about the House of the Howls? Ah. It to Bando! It to Band! How are <sighs> Well... What was that about the factory again? Ah. I had the fastest shovel on this side of the Autumn Forest. What I liked best was to shovel coal in the heat of the furnace. Above me, the ear-deafening noise of the pearl press. Wham! Boom! Look here, Mother Nature! Your masterpiece is being surpassed by the power of muscles and machinery! Mando, I'm warning you! <sighs> Nothing lasts forever. What was that about the bell again? Ah, uh, those were the days. I used to run to the entrance of the village every noon, to sound the bell for lunch. The sound traveled all over the lake. Dong! 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 Listen here, inhabitants of the lake! Bando tells you that it's time for lunch! Put away your worldly chores! It's time to eat now! Dong! 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 Bando! One more disturbance, and I'll go nuts! <sighs> Those days are long gone. Couldn't you learn something different? Hmm? Something different? <laughs> Sounds exciting. What do you propose? You could become a drummer. Hmm? Drummer? I bet I'd be a great drummer. I could play the barrel drum in an orchestra. I'd be louder than anyone else! And the cello players would get to feel my drumstick. The audience would go crazy! Bando! Bando? I can hear them holler even now! Bando! Bando! Be quiet already! Ah. Uh, yeah. You know what? I think I'd better skip that. I don't think Reuben would approve. 
You could go into road construction. That's not a bad idea. The streets here could use a makeover. And who could do the job better than I? Cobblestone after cobblestone would have to be pounded into the soil. Wham! Wham! Listen here, oh world! This island will soon have a new road! And after the road is finished, there'll be a bridge to build! And after the bridge, a tunnel directly to Corona! And finally, a master of road construction will rule again! Hooray to Bondal, the master of road construction! Hip hip hooray! Bando, I'm about to lose my patience with you! Oh, uh oh, my fantasies just got the better of me.